Blaney has the acceleration. They're up in the east banking for the final time. It's going to all come down to this breaking zone. Try to force a mistake is all Chase Elliott can do. Push him. You know he's going to push him hard. Man, he's got brake. Look how the brakes are oh, hot. He gets there. He's there. Brakes are Elliott Smoke. inside in the chicane. Oh, oh, pounds oh, Ryan Blaney. Here comes Kyle, Here comes Boy. Kyle, Kyle Busch. Busch. <laughs> And it's a drag race to the line. <laughs> Kyle Busch is going to steal the Busch Clash. They're all trying to build that run that Keselowski did. Here goes the three car. Will Dylan have help? No, they come down to block. Logano goes back up. Keselowski with him. McDowell in tow. Dylan on the bottom. The run's on top. Oh! Teammates. Around they go in a hard crash. Kyle Busch. Kyle Larson. And the order of finish at the run. moment of caution. Huge run, went for it. Joey was obviously had to block. The question is, where did that caution come out? Chase Elliott pulls ahead of Michael McDowell. Oh, look at the run he got right there, though. McDowell, the run on the outside with a little help caution. from Hamlin. And Michael McDowell from Glendale, Arizona, for Bob Jenkins Front Row Motorsports, has won the Daytona 500. How about that? Man. Kyle Larson trying to join the legends of NASCAR. Only eight before him have ever won four. Oh, he's got a flat tire to the left front tire's flat. It's down. He's going to go into the wall. Kyle We're Larson in the wall. Right, the 48 of Bowman's going to get by him. A flat tire for Kyle Larson. And now Alex Bowman is going to win at Pocono. Unbelievable. Here he comes into turn one. Chase Briscoe is going to give him a run for the money. Here's Briscoe to the outside, but he's going to be offline. No, again. Oh, Briscoe's in the grass. Now it's a battle for the lead with Hamlin and Allmendinger. Oh, stop and go for the 14 car. He is not racing for the win. Oh, he's got to spin Denny. Denny has spun out. The 14 car spun Denny Hamlin out into turn 10. That puts A.J. Allmendinger in the lead because Briscoe will have to serve a penalty. Come here and pull off the most amazing win of his career at Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Another chapter written into the Indy history books. A.J. Allmendinger will cross the yard of bricks, the winner of the first ever road course race for the Cup Series. <laughs> Let's go! Obendinger up the racetrack, they make contact! Three wide for the lead, one lap to go. Here comes Allgaier on the inside. They go up the racetrack, Obendinger back in on the inside. He takes the lead, more contact behind him. The race for the win, through three and four. Obendinger, Cedric, side by side. Obendinger wins it at the line. Off into turn one. Stay bottom, stay bottom. Algar to the middle, Algar to the middle. There you go, 10 pushes, 10 pushes. Good work, good work. 10 inside, inside with a 10, 11 with you, 11 with you. Middle three, clear three bottom, wide. clear bottom. Get to the bottom. Macaulay cars. Get to the bottom. Controlling the field off of turn four. AJ Allmendinger with the hill, but the outside line has the momentum. Haley crosses the finish line and wins. Todd Gilliland leads with Fogelman third and they're wrecking behind them. Still green, coming to the end. They're still green and Nemechek makes Nemechek a move to the inside. To the bottom, John Hunter Nemechek getting a push, trying to make it to the line. Fogelman is behind him. Fogelman wants to make a move. Can Tate Fogelman do it? Oh. He wrecks Nemechek and it's Fogelman. Fogelman. Tate Fogelman wins. Wow, and the truck is now destroyed. <laughs> Remember, Smith's got a win. Is he going to put it in there? You can hit those both of them and get the lead. Zane Smith, it's three wide as they come to the line. The white oh, flag no, is out. Him. Gilliland they took the spins. They and took the three light. And the three. caution is out. Wait. They oh. have crossed the line and taken the white flag, and the next flag wins it, and that is Zane Smith. A near-perfect race for Denny Hamlin. Entering the playoffs, he was second in the regular season, but one of only three drivers that were winless, and now he's slow on the track to five right up behind him.
Smoke coming out from Larson. Larson up against the wall. It's a drag race to the checkered flag. Denny Hamlin's going to win it. No one's got to get that car back to the bottom of the racetrack. Cannot show Austin Cindric the inside lane. Sam Mayer to the inside for third, the 18 car. Cindric mentioned how badly he wanted a grandfather clock. What will he do in three and four? Up the racetrack goes Noah Gregson. Here comes Cindric to the inside. It's a drag race. Cindric and Gregson's going to win. Why, hell yeah, dude. I'm telling you, the 04 truck is pushing Sheldon Creed. Look at that. White flag, huge One to push. Go. Creed up top, and there was some contact in the wall by Roper, and now Roper goes to the bottom. Good move. Corey Tip. Roper to the front. Ben Roach is backed up. He's going to get a little bit of a run right here on him. Here Corey comes his Roper, teammate. Roper, the Texan, trying to hold on, 43 years old. Oh, Big crash, and Ben Rhodes going around the outside and across the line. Jordan Anderson with the huge run. But it's Ben Rhodes, the winner. Now the 18 ducks in behind. One more chance. The 22 in front. The 18 closing the gap. And a four. They're and side by down. side. Just silenced the doubters. He's made his own history. Daniel Hemrick wins. He's the Xfinity Series champion. You got it. He gets back to that yellow line right around the bottom, all the way through turn one and two. Mark Martin is driving the race of his life. And there's nobody that's better at holding people off at Daytona. And Kyle Busch lagged back a little bit. Is he going to get help? Is he going to come? He's looking. Almost, he almost squeezed Harvick into the wall, and here comes Harvick, the 29, Coming with Matt Kenseth. Oh, Mark Coming got outside. loose. Watch Mark got bottom. loose, and this. Harvick's getting a run off turn four. It's going to be a drag race all the way back to the start-finish line. No caution. They're side by side, right to the line. Big crash. Here they come. Checkered flag. Harvick. Kevin Harvick wins the Daytona 500. We got one car and there's still on his roof coming across the start finish line. They're still wrecking. Warrior. They're wrecking everywhere. See, oh, Jimmy. Trouble. Kenseth in the wall. Biffle in the wall. Kenseth spins into the pack. And as we sit here with that lightning pounding down and the rain pouring down, NASCAR has just made the race official, I am being told. And Jeff Gordon is going to get that elusive first win of this season. And I don't know if you've ever, I can't recall off the top of my head this quickly, if you ever kind of stole one in the rain or by circumstances, but he's got nothing to apologize for, for to anybody. One lap to go. The white flag they in the out. The I mean, they out. And he's very slow. He's trying to make it all the way around. He might be slowing way down just to let the guy behind him catch up because it's Matt Kenseth who was 16 seconds behind him. He has 15 seconds. He can push the clutch in, coast when he can. But, Jeff, I don't see it accelerating off the corner. Out. I think he's completely out of fuel. He's out. He's shaking it, trying to get gas. The guy behind him, Matt Kenseth, could he's steal out. it. Matt Kenseth could steal this one away, or he's got Brad Keselowski behind him that could take it as well if Matt Kenseth can't hang on. Will he have enough fuel? Good job, buddy. Matt yeah. Kenseth is going to win at Pocono. Harvick, Burton, Bush, Edwards, Stewart, Reagan, green flag, two to go. Boy, Dale Earnhardt Four Jr. Car. got a great race Four start. He's out of gas, and there they go. And Burton goes around. A lot of smoke. They had a little bit of a rag back here, no caution. Keselowski got bounced around, but we are still green. Track's clear, we're good to go. Seven back, seven back. Harvick third, Reagan fourth, Logano fifth. What a topsy-turvy finish to the Coca-Cola 600. And Dale Jr. is scooting away. Uh-oh, uh-oh, he's slowing, isn't he? 150,000 people on their feet. Jr. Earth is slowing, he's out of fuel. He's out of gas. Out of gas. And as at Indy, the leader at turn four does not get to the flag. Harvick, Harvick, the closer, wins it. Once again, where did he come from? <laughs> it is four car lengths. It is three car lengths. 
As the white flag waves, they have one lap. Can Jeff Burton get there? Well, he's not fading now. Jeff Burton is right there. It's a car length. It's a half a car length. He's making his ground on the top side of the racetrack. The season goes to the top, wide open on the top of the track. It's going to be a drag race right to the end. Here goes Burton on the high side. Bush makes the block out of turn four. Burton squeezes high. They are door to door. Jeff Burton. Good job. Jeff Burton takes the win, and Kyle Bush slams the wall on the outside. Unbelievable. You saw the 29 of Here Jeff right, Burton. Kyle.